I am constantly amazed by people who think that a five-point harness is useless on a non-motion rig. Well, you're partially correct because you, it's not like you're going to fall out of the seat. I mean, you're probably not. Now, if you're a vigorous VR user like I am, there's a chance you might fall out of the seat. When you put that VR headset on, it's a different world. However, what if I told you there's a way to take advantage of that harness on a non-motion rig? Now, it's a simple idea and it's way thinking outside the box, but it's so simple and it works so good that it's worth trying. Here's the secret. Attach bungee cords to the shoulder straps. Go ahead and attach your five point uh, anchors to your rig just like you normally would, but instead of attaching the shoulders and bolting them down to the frame, attach them to bungee cords and then attach the bungee cords to the bottom of the frame. What that does is, once you sit in, you get cinched in, you'll feel that pull from the bungee cord. It's just, it's not gonna be a lot, or you can adjust it to the amount of, of, uh, of pull you want. But once you get buckled in, you cinch it in, it's gonna feel, you're gonna feel it on your shoulders. And if you have a butt kicker or some type of base shaker, man, you're, it's gonna enhance that. It's gonna radiate through your seat. It's gonna radiate through the shoulder straps. It's gonna feel really good. And what, because it's on the bungee cord, it'll allow you some freedom to move. So if you're dog fighting in a flight sim, you can actually move and you'll feel that the tension where you, as you get, as you pull away from the seat, you don't want to pull you back in. It, it's not G-forces. Don't get me wrong. Don't get twisted. I'm not saying it's the same thing as G-forces, but you do get that sense of being at the, at the end of it and being forced back into your seat, which is pretty damn amazing. I've got the bungee cords that I use. I used to, the bungee cords that I use. They're six inch to 48 inch adjustable hook bungee cords. Uh, that works for me because you can adjust it to whatever tension you want, kind of. Now, these bungee cords can be found at any, uh, uh, any supply store or uh, any hardware store, Home Depot, Lowe's. You might even be able to find them at your local grocery store. Mine were like $7 a piece. So for 15 bucks, man, I'm able to get that sensation of being actually in an aircraft or in a race car and get that feel of being pulled into the seat from it it's well worth $15. Now, if it doesn't work for you, I get it. I understand. Leave me a comment, like this video, share this video, subscribe or follow, and leave a comment. Try it. If it works for you, give me a thumbs up, say something. If it doesn't work, tell me about that too. Let me know. I'm always interested to hear what you guys are up to or what you're thinking. It's 15 bucks. What do you got to lose? Give it a shot.